Hey, good morning. We got a nice little lineup here of uh, cars going through. We're just going to move a few through. Once again, it's the BT Christmas tree sale that we're doing this morning. This is the drive through area where people can just drive their cars through, pick up a tree. You can see Jason there helping out. We're going to move that all the way through. Get. I just got to get a little bit of the traffic. But one thing we want to talk to you about here is uh, safety. And that is if you buy a Christmas tree, how do you attach it to a car? What do you do for safety? So if we can hold that car there, bring the camera right across. We're going to get this gentleman to stop right there. We're going to talk to Sylvana from CA. And Sylvana, you always have some good tips on what people should be doing to make sure that their load is secure. Definitely. A Christmas tree can be dangerous if it's not securely tied to your vehicle. So if you're coming down and picking up a Christmas tree and going to be putting, putting it on the roof of your vehicle, we recommend that you use ratchet straps. Make sure that the base of the tree is facing forward. We recommend using three ratchet straps one around the base, one around the center, and the other around the tip of the tree. Make sure that they're hooked onto the roof rack and then securely tightened before you drive off. By doing this, this will reduce any movement on the roof of the vehicle in case of strong winds or a, a sudden stop. And the ratchet straps exactly what they use on tractor trailers for some of the flatbeds. Definitely. No matter what your load is, ratchet straps are definitely a good thing to use in order to secure uh, your load to the vehicle. We find that bungee cords and ropes don't do the job as well. There's a, a study out of Germany that shows uh, in a crash, bungee cords will shred. So that's why we do recommend using ratchet straps instead. And you can also use it in the trunk of your vehicle. Again, make sure that the base of the tree uh, goes in first and is facing forward. Lower down your back seats and then use the ratchet straps to wrap around the tree and secure either to the floor or the sidewalls of your trunk. Oh, that's amazing. Thank you very much. And, and anything going on with the CAA? I know uh, with snowbirds and people traveling south, there's always great resources there to find out uh, different incentives and also travel routes. Definitely. We do recommend people go to our website at www.caasco.com for more information. And we're gearing up for the winter season. We've got snow coming this weekend, so it'll be busy. It will be busy. Thank you very much, yep. Savannah. And oh, this gentleman here, uh, you this is your car. Yes. <laughs> this is it. So we're strapping the tree down there. Um, would you like an overnight stay at the Sheridan Hotel? Sure. Okay, I'm not going to give you one then. Uh, yes, exactly, I'm going to give you that. This is a value of $289. It's also a dinner for two at the B&B &B restaurant. So wow, Merry great. Christmas to thank you. Thank you, thank you. And make sure that your load is very secure. Yes, thank you. Okay, we're going to take a break right now. We're going to send it right back over to Kevin.